Salons and barbershops are internationally recognized by their tricolored spinning poles, usually displayed outside of their business. Come on, Jimmy, man, just two seconds, yeah, right? One time to go. I promise you're done. Wait. The red, white, and blue poles have a story of their own, and it starts a long time ago. This better be good. Back in the Middle Ages, patrons went to the barber for other services besides just a haircut. As barber surgeons, they were also responsible for bloodletting and other medical operations of the time. That included dental surgery, fixing broken bones, dressing wounds, and even amputations. According to history, during bloodletting, which involves cutting open a vein and allowing blood to drain, the barber would give their patient a pole to hold on to, to make the veins and the arms stand out more predominantly for the procedure. The barbers would then use a white cloth to soak up the blood. The Reader's Digest notes that they'd then tie those towels to the poles and hang them outside their shops, which is one of the theories behind the iconic spinning poles we see today. The red in the pole symbolizes blood, and the white stands for the bandages. Traditionally, European barber poles are red and white. American barbershop poles match the color of the flag, and the blue is said to represent the vein's color before the blood is let out. Starting hundreds of years ago, barbers were no longer legally able to undertake medical or surgical practices, but the poles remained steadfast as a symbol of the history of their profession. The look of the barber pole is linked to bloodletting, with red representing blood and white representing the bandages used to stand the bleeding. The pole itself is said to symbolize the stick that the patient squeezed to make the veins in his arm stand out more prominently for the procedure. In Europe, barber poles traditionally are red and white, while in America, the poles are red, white and blue. One theory holds that blue is symbolic of the veins cut during bloodletting, while another interpretation suggests blue was added to the pole as a show of patriotism and a nod to the nation's flag. By the mid-1500s, English barbers were banned from providing surgical treatments, although they could continue extracting teeth. Both barbers and surgeons, however, remained part of the same trade guild until 1745.